what causes skin cancer uh, known as basal cell carcinoma and squamous cell carcinoma? So it's important to say that those are two separate forms of skin cancer, uh, but we group them together to talk about the non-melanoma types of skin cancer. And in fact, um, they're the two commonest types of skin cancer that we see. Um, and we might see them, um, we might see basal cell carcinoma appearing as a very slowly growing uh, nodule, um, a skin colored or red nodule um, on a sun exposed um, part of your skin um, that uh, is painless and can bleed and scab and can grow over the course of months to years. Um, with a squamous cell carcinoma, um, it would uh, be a similar appearance, but it would grow much faster and it could be uh, painful. Um, and they're both um, uh, conditions that can be caused really by a combination of uh, fair skin um, and sun exposure, so mainly ultraviolet light uh, exposure. Um, and it really does depend on the type of, uh, what we say, what the type of risk factors that one might have. So um, you might have excessive light exposure as a result of your job, uh, whether you uh, have lived abroad, whether you have a lot of outdoor hobbies, um, and uh, essentially um, how long you've, you've been on this earth and how long you've been exposed to um, sunlight for. So we do tend to see it in middle age uh, onwards. So those are the main causes of these types of skin cancer. If you notice that you have any of the symptoms or the conditions that we've just discussed, we invite you to book a consultation with Ms. Penelope Pratsu, where she'll be able to assess your condition and give you a treatment plan. Thank you.